Hey, my name is Kathy. I'm the Tidy Tutor, and I want to talk to you about something that happened to me yesterday. This is Motivation Monday, and it will make sense as we go along. I went into New York City to meet someone. Her name was Hoon Yi. She is amazing. Now, we met in a place called the Writer's Room. Urban Writing Colony. It's like an oasis for writers. She's on the board of directors, and she introduced me to the executive director, Donna. Donna Brody, actually, is her name. And we sat down and had a cup of tea together, and it really was a revelation for me. Did you know that there are very famous people, novelists and playwrights, that need to get out of the house and go somewhere to write. It turns out that if they were to stay home to do it, oftentimes they get very little done. This has been around for many, many years. Many people have voiced their opinion that they get more done in one day than they would in six weeks at home. You're not much different than they are, not at all. We are actually just like them. And I'll bet you that many of them live in a mess behind their front doors. Now remember, messy people aren't dirty people, although there are times that we would get depressed because of the mess that surrounds us, that we would just stay in bed and just not care that the dog chewed up the garbage. We would just lay there because we would say, oh my God, something else that I have to do on top of what I have to do that I'm not doing. So don't think I don't understand. I absolutely do. So here's the thing. There are people out there that have figured out that they have a dream and a desire and a talent and they do what it takes to make it happen. Even if it means leaving the house, paying for workspace, to have camaraderie and to have a fellowship, to have a reason to do what it is that your heart is telling you to do, to go somewhere and do it. Now Donna told me about someone who, I'm so sorry that I can't remember his name, but as soon as I find out, I will let you know. But he's a famous author, and what he has done forever, dressed himself in a suit, gone down to his workspace in the basement, and went to work as if he went to work. Because if he didn't do that, he didn't get any writing done. Now isn't it the same thing with us, with homemaking, with housekeeping, with cleaning the house? Now if you're a stay-at-home mom, or you work from home, it is so easy to just wake up, not get dressed, not do what you need to do, and think that it doesn't matter. It matters. Your life matters. What you do matter. It's as if you are an executive at home. Just like the book that I originally read that started me on my journey toward order called Sidetracked Home Executives say that you are an executive of the home. You know, the whole world exists behind our front doors. When what is behind our front doors is harmonious, so is our world. So today for our Motivation Monday, what I am encouraging you to do is to see your life as important to see what you do as important, to do what it takes to motivate yourself to get yourself to the point where you do what you have to do. That's what I'm here for. You can go on my Facebook page and you can post what you have to do and then you can get some accountability. Say, this is what I have to do, this is what I've done. I swear to you I'll be there with a cyber high five. I really will. Now soon, I'm going to have what we call a membership site. That is where you come in to my place and I motivate you, I help you, I guide you along. Abilities, you have videos that you could click on that are called papers, or how to get the dinner party started, or my mother-in-law is coming, what the F do I do? Lots of help to get yourself moving and motivated 
also there'll be a chat room. I'm really looking forward to this. For now, it is what it is. My name is Kathy Roberts. I'm the Tidy Tutor, and I thank you so much for joining me. Please like this video, leave me a comment. I absolutely love to hear from you. All right, I'm in Manhattan, and I just thought that I would show you around. Memorial Day, and the city is bustling. It's freaking great. If you ever have a chance to come to New York City, come to New York City. I'm Kathy, the Tidy Tutor. Just thought I'd show you around New York for just a second.